Up next, I'm being held against my will. This is your wake-up call. Prepare to die. Welcome to Trivia Murder Party. Sorry, we're out of rooms, but we have plenty of deadly trivia. Only one of you will survive, but the memories we create will live on forever. Alright, first question. What keeps Georgia on Ray Charles' mind? Use your device to answer the question. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? Which leaves only you. It's time. And here are your bags. Welcome to room 105. I'm going to give you a chance to password protect your life. Enter a real four-letter word with your device. Don't make it easy. If someone cracks your password, you die. Come on. Now everyone else will try to crack the password. As a team, guess the password on your device. You get a clue if your guess has a letter in the right spot. If anyone figures out the password before time runs out, I will reward you all. Don't be greedy about what letters you figured out. Let everyone know. Almost up. I thought everyone was good at hacking passwords these days, but I guess I was wrong. I always want to just push all the buttons, but don't worry, I'll stay focused. Let's try another one. In the poem, A Visit from St. Nicholas, what does Santa say first? <laughs> Who picked this? The rest of you, follow me. Welcome to room 217. Are you ready to fall? In love with my new minigame? You're going to drop down this board and try to avoid the death zones. Hmm, someone needs to pick which slots are death zones. Hey you, pick the landing slots that kill. Okay. Let the games begin! Pick a spot to drop from. It's fun! Pick a spot... I made this board in shop class! Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I should've made them all death zones. Hosting my games in this old hotel is just a temporary thing, you know. I hope to one day kill people at a summer camp. Let's keep moving. What's an inch? Picked 
this. The rest of you, come with me. Ah, the lost art of letter writing. I'm going to dictate a message to you. Write down as much of what I say as you can. The player who writes the fewest of my words will die. And the letter begins... Now! Dear local action news team, do you take requests? I would like to see more uplifting feature stories that share positive images and less segments about the crimes that I have committed. Viewers are tired of all the sad stories I am directly responsible for. Time's up! Now let me just see what we have here with a, um, quick... And here's how you did! Yikes! One of you did real bad! That's not even close to what I said. We're not done with you yet. Dying doesn't mean you have to drop out. Keep playing and you just might steal someone else's life force and win the game. We're here! When one player is left alive, we'll go to the final round. Next question! According to the popular podcast, what is 99% invisible? out who picked this the rest of you who are still alive time for consequences ah the spirit of giving you each get five hundred dollars give some of that money to your friend the person with the most cash at the end will die. But there's a catch. If one of you ends up with $800 or more, I'll kill the other one instead. Begin. me the money! Too rich for your blood. <laughs> Let's try another one. Which of these countries has some mountains? This one should be easy. Follow as many rules as you can before time runs out. Everyone else is playing too. If any of them correctly follow more rules than you, I will kill you. The rules are already on your device. Go, go! There's not a lot for me to do during this game. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll update my LinkedIn account. Almost out of rules time!
Well, now I'm mad at everybody. This hotel hasn't been updated much since I was a kid. Same carpet, a lot of the same blood stains. Ah, it really brings me back. Let's keep moving. What gets a soccer or football player thrown out of a game? Time to bring out the chalices. I've given each safe player a poison pellet. Pick a chalice to drop your poison in. Now it's your turn to play. Pick a chalice to drink from. Ah, that's the good stuff. Now let's see what you drank. Did somebody order the poison with a splash of death? <laughs> let's try another one. When life flips you upside down and drops you headfirst into the floor, what professional wrestling move is that? Only a ghost got it wrong. I don't like seeing that. Let's keep moving. What percentage of PP is just water? Follow me. It's tattoo time! Create a new tattoo on my back by drawing on your device. Yeah, harder. Bring it. Ooh. Yeah. The process is complete. Now vote for your favorite tat. The artist with the fewest votes will die. Uh. <laughs> Vote already! Uh. What did we decide? Well, at least tattoos aren't permanent. What? They are! I will have my revenge! <laughs> Only one of you is still alive. You know what that means. Congrats on making it here alive! But can you escape? I'm going to give you a category. Practices of the Buddhist Eightfold Path. Tap each answer that fits the category, and then press Submit. Let's see the right answers. 
you move forward one space for each correct answer. You're on your way to escaping! Oh, did I mention that all the other ghosts get to play too? If a ghost catches up with you, they will steal your life force. Then they can escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. Time is almost up. Melissa McCarthy movies. I'm going too easy on you. Next question. Movies directed by women. Fall behind. Here comes the darkness. Countries on the equator. Time is almost up. Chicken breeds. Moving on. One term U.S. presidents. back because there's a ghost right there! Don't let the darkness hit you on the way out. Room shades. Time is almost up. Stole some yummy life force. Kentucky Derby winner. Here comes the next question. Countries with red, white, and blue flags. A lot of lucky guesses. Where do you think you're going? You need a perfect answer for your final escape. And that includes the third answer choice now, too. You have to get all the right answers to escape.
Welcome back! Remember, breakfast is 6 a.m. to 9.30, the pool's open till 11 p.m., and of course, murder is 24 hours. First question. Which of these TV shows does not feature Ariana Grande in an acting role? Use your device to answer the question. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? The rest of you, time for consequences! Welcome to room 101, it's non-smoking! Let's use one of my cousin Aloysius's old stage props! Pick a space inside the box to hide! Oh, I sure do hope you're claustrophobic! <laughs> Any good magic trick needs some helpful volunteers. Now, can you confirm that we've never met before? <laughs> Just kidding. A little magician banter. You get a sword. On your device, choose a row or a column to run your... Stab, stab! Oh, I needed that! Let's try another one. Hey, let's get our story straight when the police ask questions about this fun game tonight. What does alibi mean, in Latin? of you who are still alive, it's time. Welcome to room 237. Hopefully you can defend yourself from ESP. Type in an answer that fits this category. Everyone else will answer too. And if anyone matches you, you die. And I do mean anyone. Time's almost... One of you didn't answer. That's unforgivable. Anyway, moving on. Jinx, you owe me a death. Let's keep moving. Where is Sam I Am not offered green eggs and ham? Come with me! I'm giving you the laziest gift of all! A scratch ticket! 
scratch and find three dollar signs to live. If you keep scratching, I'll give you cash for every dollar sign you find. But if you scratch off even one skull, you die. Happy scratching! Come on, you could scratch more. We know what a losing ticket means. We're here! The final round is close. Next question! How do I sleep at night? Who <laughs> picked this? Only a ghost got it wrong. Way too easy. Let's try another one. What would you not find in a classic game of Hungry Hungry Hippos? Everyone again? You all need to be taught a lesson. There's nothing more fun than fogged up mirrors. Oh hey look! The ghost of my Aunt Mildred is writing on this mirror. She has her own consistent handwriting. Now, Aunt Mildred is going to write a different word. But so will all the safe players. Draw a word on the mirror and maybe you'll trick someone into thinking it's Aunt Mildred's. Start writing on that mirror. Pay attention to the words as they appear and try to spot my auntie. So many convincing words to choose from. Now, type the word that Aunt Mildred wrote or you die. Would the real Aunt Mildred please stand up? Oh, you got it! This is my second most disappointing experience with a mirror. Only one of you is still alive. You know what that means. Glad to see you're the one to make it here alive, but will you be the one to escape? Here's your first category. Detective on a Law & Order Show. Tap each answer that fits the category and then press Submit. Let's see the right answers. Nocturnal Animals. Time is almost up! Muscles in the human body. It's not too late to close this gap! Cat breeds! Hmm. You're better than I thought. Don't 
look behind you! It's only darkness. Antihistamines. Time is almost up. Getting pretty close to the exit. Part of Alexander the Great's Empire. Gotta get some harder question. Uh uh uh, not so fast. If you want to break through that barrier, you'll need a perfect answer to this question. And that includes the third answer choice now, too. Welcome aboard! I'm Chuck Hull, your captain and host for the evening. Go ahead and sign in. Oh, please, whenever you're ready. comedians here's tonight's itinerary we're gonna write some jokes and then test them out on stage but first things first it's brainstorming time before we jump into the jokes let's do a little writing exercise to get inspired on your device you'll be prompted to write various topics like animals people or objects fill in whatever you think has a lot of comedic potential if another player uses one of your topics in a winning joke you'll get some bonus points Generate as many as you can. You have 45 seconds, starting now.
Get what you can in. We'll be moving on soon. Now follow the steps on your device to write two jokes. This is where the magic happens. We've hit the halfway How about it, folks? A big round of applause for that hip-hop group, Nautical by Nature. Now, let's switch gears to some comedy. Let's welcome our first comedian to the stage. Oh, boy, he said he... <laughs> Which comedian won that face off? And some credit to you! Our next comic needs no introduction. Did squaws a tie on to a V? Squaw the trust a how? Let us know which joke you liked the most. And a tip of the hat to you! Alright, let's hear it for the next perform- 
Dem hotz how do Time or two quality a squat see ho the Okay, up next. Some points for you as well. Our next comic needs an introduction. Ready, <laughs> Let's see who's on top and who is scraping the bottom of the barrel. If you're at the top, that means you're the headliner right now. You've got the wind in your sails now, so let's write some more jokes.
move on to your second jokes. I hope you're not sick of seeing these performers, because here they are again! I <laughs> got... <laughs> Which comedian told a better joke? Folks, put your hand and hook together for our next comedian. <laughs> Which comedian told a better joke? Look now. Keep this joke boat moving and welcome our next comic to the stage! You know him, you love him, it's this person. I'm a two Ludu Panubi at Let's keep
things going for the next comp. Let's play a little shuffleboard. If you're at the top, that means you're the headliner right now. Well, we're sinking again. There's no time to write jokes from scratch. So, here's the plan. Let's rewrite another comic's joke. You'll use the same setup, but we'll attempt to write a funnier punchline. The better the original joke did, the more points you'll earn for beating it. Can you steal the spotlight before the boat sinks? Let's find out! We do have an official evacuation procedure that we will tell you after we bring back our comics one more time! Yeah, I did. I am a... I am a pun... Did they successfully beat this joke? Vote now!
Vote for your favorite punchline! is leaving with me in the lifeboat. Let's find out who deserves it the most.
Welcome to the Dictionarium, a place for people who love words or just want to get to know them better as friends. What a crowd! In the Dictionarium, you will create a dictionary entry for a made-up word and you will win if your answers get the most votes. Let us begin! First things first, I'm sending a word to your device. Write down a definition that you think fits this word. I saw this word on an online dating profile. I was intrigued, but I swiped left because I don't like when men pose with fish. You might not be able to use all your favorite letters. Choose wisely. Let's see what we have. And now it's time to vote. Pick your favorite definition or, you know, the one that ignites your soul. Remember, you can award bonus points to the ones that stole your heart. And the winning definition to be recorded forever in the Dictionarium is... <laughs> toot toot! This dictionary entry needs a synonym! Write down a new word, something that matches the definition on your device. This round is quick, so please write fast! So submit your cinnamon! Show me the word! The word that is super matchy-matchy with the definition. And the winner is...
Now we have a brand new word and definition. Let's use it. Write a sentence using the word on your device. I hereby sentence you to writing a sentence. Hee hee hee. I am thrilled to present your sentences. Time to vote! The votes are in, and the winning sentence is... This is going straight into the Dictionarium Archives. Thank you. Oh, and now we get to see who won. See you again very soon. I just get very lonely. The game that you are playing, well, it causes much hilarium. You make up silly words and phrases ending in hysterium. You have to answer quickly. No, you really mustn't carry them. And anybody can compete. A Tom, a Dick, a Harryum. So gather in the living room. Pull up a stool or charium. With lots of foods and beverages like milk or juice or barium. Then start to make your crazy words and don't forget to vary them. And that is how you win a dictionarium. Dictionarium, dictionarium. With words you will not find in the librarium. Dictionary on, dictionary on. This time you broaden your vocabulary on. You've got to be creative, sense of humor is necessary. Your definitions must stand out, we don't want ordinarium. To finish as the winner, well, you can't be secondarium. You've got to be the boss, don't settle for the secretarium. Anyone can play a baby or a centenarium. Play it with your friends or even with your adversariums. Any time of year is fine in May or Januaryum. There's no excuse to not play dictionarium. Dictionarium, dictionarium. With words you will not find in the librarium. Dictionarium, dictionarium. It's time you broaden your vocabulary. Um. By the time you finish playing, you will be extraordinary. Um. Your brain will be gigantic, all your friends will stop and stare. Um. And Harvard will bestow upon you doctorates honorarium. At spelling bees, they'll spell your words, you will be legendary. Um. So cancel all your meetings and clear your itinerarium. Throw a party right away, waste not a momentarium. Get ready to have so much fun, it's really kinda scary. Um. Join hands and sing the song of dictionarium. 
Dictionary on, Dictionary on, with words you will not find in the library on. Dictionary on, Dictionary on, it's time to broaden your vocabulary on.